Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to look at some uh, old vintage uh, bike gear. Uh, just a Nash bar. I had this for maybe about 10, 12 years. Um, I had it in my pack for a while. I used to cycle a lot. I don't seen it in my other videos. So it is an old school style um, pack. Um, as you can see here, I've added a couple things. These are obviously from Park Tools. Uh, it has to have another one that came out earlier. But it has, you know, for these are for the brakes. Um, obviously, this is an old, old style of how you hold the brakes when you want to adjust them. So this goes over uh, the caliper and it holds it in place while you pull the, um, the wire and then you tighten it with the with your screwdriver, it just one has one here, and it's got obviously a double-sided uh, screwdriver for a bit, the Phillips, and the flathead on this side, I need to stick it in here, well, it should be sticking it stick in here, that's what it comes with it, there you go, so you stick it in here, and it works perfectly, same side on this side, there you go, perfect. So it's a mini kit, um, obviously it's an older style mini kit. Uh, if ever you get into any trouble with your bike, this is to take off the tire. Take off your tire off the off the rim. So it does come with a lot of little miniature stuff. It's pretty good um, to tighten up your your, um, your brakes, um, your tire, anything like that. It comes with a 10 millimeter here. A seven millimeter. No, no, it's, these are all tens, I believe. They look like all tens. I don't know why I have all tens. Yeah, these are all tens. Uh, on this side, we have a 13, 11, and a 14. So these are all different kinds. These are tens, tens, and tens. So I guess they decided to put a bunch of tens on this side for some reason. I don't know why they would have that all on this side, but these are all tens so it's a nice little pack uh, you know that you'd have in here old stuff old school style but um, yeah it looks really nice I said it, it's vintage um, the way everything was made so if you ever get a chance to find one of these I would advise you to get one I mean it's it's old school you know it's, it's what you have it's what you get it's not you know, it's something you would want if you're, you know, vintage stuff. You know, if you're a collector, this is stuff you would collect. But that's about it. It's not something that you, you know, have a lot. It's something you put up on your wall, maybe. You know, stuff like this. Uh, they do work. They do work. I wouldn't say they don't work. They do actually work uh, for what you have, what you need. Because I've tried to use them. Uh, obviously, I have used them. I used to work a lot on bikes. You know, I have, uh, I have uh, you know, like 20 bikes right now that I have worked on them, I have hundreds upon hundreds of pieces of uh, bikes, parts and all that stuff so um, this does I, this does work and I have worked with all this stuff uh, as you can see there's a lot of wear and tear on this uh, so I have used this a lot um, so yeah if uh, you ever come through a, a set like this it's a, a pretty nice to have it is made in Taiwan um, you know but if you ever get anything like this uh, you know Keep it. If you're gonna find a garage sale, anything like that, um, flea market. I would advise you to get it. Um, that's my point of view. Thank you guys for watching. Like and subscribe, guys. Thank you.